Hey guys, Miss Higgins here. I wanted to make a quick tutorial video to show you how to sign up for and then sign in to your child's DOE Zoom account. So first you'll need to come to this website, nycdoe.zoom.us. You're gonna click sign in, and then at the bottom under students, you're gonna click find your username slash reset your password. So you'll need your child's OSIS or ID number and then their date of birth. Uh, if you forgot the OSIS number, just reach out to your classroom teacher. They should have that information for you. So I'm going to put in a sample student's OSIS number and birthday. Uh, and then it's going to give you your username, but you'll create your own password. Now, the problem is they only give you part of the username. So Vanessa M232, what they don't tell you is that it actually ends in at nyc students with an s dot net so that is their email address for the doe and that's also their username for uh, the doe zoom so please make sure you put that at the end and then write that down click continue you'll create your own password write that down too uh, then click update and you'll be good to go so then the next step is actually joining a Zoom meeting. So there's two ways that you can do that. The first way is to go to the Zoom app or the Zoom website and click join. But to join, you'll need the meeting ID and the password. So you'll write that down or you can just copy and paste. And you'll go again to the um, nycdoe.zoom.us. You'll click join and it'll ask you for the meeting ID. So let me just copy that. And then the password, and I think it might have you sign in as well. I'm already signed in, so there's a couple less steps for me. Okay, so I'll click cancel. The other way, if you don't wanna click uh, join, is you can actually just click the link. Now again, I'm already signed in, so I can't show you all the steps. Let me try to type them out for you. So once you click the link, once you click the link, you're gonna enter the username, which is really the email address and the password that you just created. Then it's gonna ask um, how you want to sign in. Do not click Google. You're actually going to click SSO or single sign on. That's how it's going to have you sign in. And then it might also ask you for the domain name. If it does, the domain is NYCDOE. Once you put in all that information, it should open up the Zoom meeting for you and it'll just say you're waiting for the host to admit you. So I hope that was helpful. Um, please reach out to me, Ms. Higgins, or to your child's classroom teacher uh, if you have any questions. Um, so yeah, have a lovely evening. Thank you.